Oh, hot August nights, no doubt about it. They are going to continue with that heat advisory in effect until 11 p.m. tonight. In fact, take a look at the four things that you need to know as you're getting out today. That heat advisory, of course, today, again, potentially on Friday. Highs near 100 today in many areas. We're going to be at 97. Isolated thunderstorms moving in later on tonight. The issue with that is the potential for dry lightning and hot and dry four days into next week. The heat advisory, there you have it, all of North Idaho, Central and Eastern Washington with extreme heat expected into the Lewiston area. They're expecting temperatures triple digits like 107. For us, it's gonna be 97 for the high today, the next 12 hours. By noon, uh, 93, 95 at five, and then uh, we'll cool into the low 80s even after the sun sets. So we're gonna hold on to some of that heat. 24 hour forecast has the showers mainly into the central place. We get a bit of a break and then boom, tonight, we're going to see 10 o'clock, really the chance of thunderstorms coming in and rolling through the area in the overnight hours through tomorrow morning. And then by 7 a.m. should be really leaving the area. So we're going to be keeping an eye on that. High stay again into the upper 90s. So please use caution. As we look at our planning forecast, well, there you have a 97 today, 95 tomorrow with cloud cover. We have 93 on Thursday, but look at Friday. That low that comes in pulls that hot air coming up, and that's going to be 97 degrees. Once that passes, we cool to around 90 for Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Potentially upper 80s. That would be nice, but it's going to get hot. It'll be above average, no doubt. And in fact, it'll get hotter next week. So the heat's here to stay, but uh, certainly you need to, again, take precautions. You can go to KXY.com to find out more about the cooling centers. And of course, the First Alert weather app is free and available in the App Store. I hope you have a great day. Stay cool, stay safe, and get those strenuous activities done in the early morning hours, including the running, the jogging, and walking of the dog.